This past April in Ukraine, a bomb shelter provided the unlikely space for a theatrical performance. The actors were all children, and their show took on greater resonance with the onset of the war. And now, against all odds, this remarkable cast has been brought here for a special performance. All new tonight, CBS 2's Dana Tyler met them at a rehearsal in Brooklyn. This quiet street in Fort Greene stands in sharp contrast to what's happening inside this former church. A young Ukrainian cast is rehearsing for an upcoming performance of Mom on Skype here at Brooklyn's Irondale Theater. Eight children, ages 7 to 14, a director mom, and other parent chaperones were invited to the U.S. from their war torn homeland for a unique presentation of their original play. These Ukrainian children, how brave they are. How did you decide on this? What do they do in the middle of a war when bombs are falling around them potentially? They decide to make a play. That's incredible. And that's what Irondale's co-founder Terry Grease helped do after reading about the show. The play was in production in Ukraine for months before the war started in February. It was performed in April only once in a warehouse turned bomb shelter in Lviv. Mom on Skype is based on a series of stories about children missing their parents who are forced to work far away from their families. All kids need is uh, love from parents. The production is a labor of love for director Oleg Onyshek, but as a soldier, he was not allowed to leave Ukraine. His wife Maria, mother of actors Hannah and Alexei, stepped in to direct stateside with Ukrainian memories ever present. When were you in the bomb shelter rehearsing and what on earth was that like? She tells us they live in Kyiv, Ukraine. We have air alarms several times a day. Tatyana Misyuha translates, describing life there. We are in the place where people would come to save their lives. She's also mom to 13-year-old Anastasia. When we went to America, it's like another life because it's without any alarms, without any dangers, without any planes, Russian planes. Themes of missing parents under the specter of today's times are never more poignant. The children can touch her parents, can hug. The show ends with an original song, a plea for peace, written and sung mostly in English by 12-year-old Hannah. Since we are one country. And for this message, Anushek finds the words in English. Please, uh, this war, this genocide must stop. Uh, because we want life, we love life, and uh, our country is very beautiful. To say our dear Ukraine. Wow. Mom on Skype is being performed at the Irondale Theater in Brooklyn tomorrow and Sunday. They travel back to Ukraine on August 21st. We have more of these amazing performers, performers on our streaming service, CBS New York, and we have links. For more information on our website, cbsnewyork.com. My goodness, what a spirit. <laughs> what, and the lessons we can all learn yeah. just by observing, so right? poignant. And how so poignant. wrapped up we may be in whatever. There's Brings that. Brings you right back. Yeah, yeah we think that. we have problems, right? And here they're saying this war's got to end because we want life. That's a pretty simple thing. They want life. Start with the basics.